This month, I spent $400 on Instagram shoutouts, and I have already generated five grand in revenue, and I've got a few more sales calls on the books and a few more people that I'm nurturing. I was shocked because I had heard shoutouts were effective, but I hadn't really tried them much. So I wanted to make a video just walking through my experience with them and also just to, to see, are shoutouts something that you can utilize for your business? If so, I also wanna show you in this video how you can utilize them. So how I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna go and pull up my Instagram account. And in here, I'm gonna show you exactly what I did. I'm gonna show you the account that I that I did my shout out from, and I'll even show you the message that I sent. When I'm in Instagram, typically when you do like shout outs, we wanna go from, from bigger account pages. The pages that do really well, surprisingly, are meme pages. I'm gonna show the one that I did, but ideally, you know, they're meme pages that have your ideal client there. Okay, so I did two, and I'll, I'll tell you exactly the two that I did, and I'll show you them, and also um, tell you what results I got from both, okay? So the first one I did was chiropractic memes. Knowing that I'm a clinician, right? I'm a physical therapist, and I've, uh, that's like, yeah, I'm a physical therapist, and like, I also help coaches and PTs and clinicians, also chiropractors go online. This is a really good page, right? Even though, look, like, you know, the, the follower account is relatively small. It's for chiropractors by chiropractors. So the majority of the followers here are chiropractors. And this is where I got, I got at least one client, if not two clients. I've got another one I had um, last month that I also did a shout on this page. And I'm not really 100% sure on if they came from this one or not. It was a really similar time, but I'm gonna show you how I do this. So a lot of these meme pages, this is what they're looking for, right? It even says DM to be featured. I did, right? So this was my post right here. I, I messaged the person and said, hey, do you do shout outs? If so, what do they cost? And they told me how much they cost. Um, at the time, they, they cost 50 bucks. I did another one that I'll show you in a second. And that one did, was uh, closer to like 300. Yeah, 300 shout out. But this was better. I mean, this was better because I had more of my ideal clients. So I paid for the shout out. And I kind of showed them, hey, this is what I was thinking as far as a meme goes, can you make this? And they're like, sure, we can do that. So they whip this up. Some, some of the accounts, like meme accounts, they'll want you to do it. Like I did the other one that I sent, but they did this one. So what I did here is I kind of utilized a meme graphic to display what I do for people, right? So me, this is the person who's looking at it, working in clinic nine to five or making money, you know, make, making 10K a month online. You know, the clinic's like, what? Right, so it's just a funny, silly meme. <laughs> it's simple, but it says, hey, make sure to go follow Dr. Matt Shiver to learn how he helps chiropractors make money online with coaching and courses. Follow, follow, follow. So there's three links in here. Somebody may like this, but that doesn't really matter. What they will do is they'll click my account, right? So this, somebody clicked my account, then they come here and they see my bio. So your bio has gotta be like up to date, right? Helping coaches and clinicians get more online coaching clients. You know, this is how many I've served since 2015. And I, I did this. So whenever I do a shout out, the call to action I have is to follow for more, right? So follow daily for, you know, for daily marketing and business tips. I'm, I'm getting a decent amount of follows doing this, like just doing, having that be my call to action. Like, I mean, this isn't a ton, but you know, in the past 24 hours, probably like 30 or so, 25, 30. That's good for me, right? Before that, I wasn't getting much money follows unless I followed somebody or like my post went viral, which wasn't happening. Somebody clicks that chiropractic meme account, they come here and they decide, do I wanna follow this person or not, right? And if your profile is set up well, and you know, you've got good story highlights, you got a good bio, it's super clean, good headshot. And then also, you know, you've got these three pen posts that kind of talks more about what you do, but this relates really well to the chiropractor. Look. Hey, I'm Matt Shiver. Today marks 24 months since I've worked as a PT. Here's what I'm doing instead, right? Here's five lessons that I learned as a PT that helped me build multiple six and seven figure coaching companies, right? But all of this kind of ties back into who's the ideal client. So when they come here, they're like, oh my gosh, this is perfect. This is exactly what I'm looking for. That's what happened. And from there, people follow me, right? So from that one post, the chiropractic meme post that I just showed you a second ago, I got over a hundred followers in a day. And then anybody that follows me, I just send a message to. So I could I could click on my followers. I could use my desktop if I want to. But let's say um, Mohammed was the guy who followed me. Actually, I, I probably wouldn't, nothing wrong with Mohammed, but I don't, I think he's foreign. And I, I typically try just to message people who are states bound because those are the people, the people that I work with. Let's say Kathleen was a, a chiropractor. I bet you, I, I bet you my team has already messaged them. Maybe not. Nope, hasn't yet. Okay, so then what I would do here was like, hey, Kathleen, thank you for the follow. I'm curious, like, how did you come across my account? Or I could be like, hey, Kathleen, how's it going? 
Like, I see that you're also a coach. How long have you been doing this for? Right, but I start, I start a conversation. So if I get 100 followers, 100 followers from that shout out, I'm going to DM 100 people. I, I might not do it in a day. If I, if I can do it in a day, I will. You wanna start about 10 to 20 conversations an hour. That's like a safe range. But if you do more than that, then you know your account could get flagged. That's 100 people or 100 potential leads. My team and I respond to all of those and we keep the conversation going. We see if they're looking for help and if they do, we, we extend a call. So with that, we booked a decent amount of calls. Not everyone's a, a, a sign up, gonna sign up the first time, but within the first week of me doing that shout out, I, I generated over five grand. That shout out, like I said, costs 50 bucks. 50 bucks, 100 followers, one client. That's a pretty good return on investment. That's a 100 times return on investment. All you have to really do is just look for meme counts that are gonna be in your in your area, right? Or in that your ideal clients would follow. Here's another one, and I did this one this week, and I thought this would do a lot better. And um, unfortunately it didn't, but again, that's, not, that, that's more because who are the ideal clients that are on there, right? So this is gym fails, right? Like people who are, like a lot of these things, I mean, they get great engagement, right? And I'm like, oh man, I bet you if I post on here, I'm also gonna get good, good engagement. But that didn't happen. And he, he, I think he took it down too, which which is normal. Like some of these people, they'll, they'll post it and then they'll take it down. Oh, no, actually it's right here. So the, I did a really similar post, right? Almost the same as the other one, but I changed the, the graphic up a little bit, right? So it's like underpaid as a trainer in the gym, me making 10K a month online, helping people get jacked. So I, I customized it a little bit more to the uh, demographic, knowing that these were gym goers, not chiropractors. And again, they could follow me. Um, I, I probably got close to another another hundred followers from these, and I got a few calls booked, but the quality was not nearly as high as as the chiropractic meme page. But that's because I really niched down, right? This one because they have more followers, and they do this regularly. This is the the business. This was a little bit more expensive. It was a couple hundred bucks. Yeah. Again, I I, I may still like reach back out to them and do something again in the future, but. 100% I want to look for more pages that are niche down, right? But if, if I can spend 50 bucks and get one client out of that, or even 50 bucks and get 100 new followers that I can nurture with my content, that's a win. And if I compare this to paid ads, right? I, I love paid ads and paid ads cost about 100 bucks, 100 to $200 for a phone call, right? So if I can do a shout out and let's say, you know, I get 100 to 500 followers and I book two, two to three calls, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm competing with the same, it, it, it's the same, if not better than paid ads, but I get to constantly nurture them because they're now new followers, right? So anybody who's a follower of mine is going to see my content. So I'm a fan of this. I'm going to keep doing this. The, the negative of this is that sometimes this can lower your engagement. Okay. If an engagement's important metric for you, that is a potential possibility that it could lower your engagement. I've seen that, it did happen for me like right after I, I did that. So like even here, like I'm not showing the, the amount of likes I got on these posts. Like I did a shout out and most of like these posts aren't aren't doing as well. And I also boosted some posts, but I'll talk about that another, another day. That was my experience. And uh, if you wanna get more traffic to your page, I recommend giving it a shot, just trying it. Okay, all you need to do, come over here, Look for a meme page in your niche gym meme nation. If I was if I was doing training, right? And this is like, or if I was a, a fitness coach and for these people, some of them, you're just gonna make sure they're active, but if they're getting a few hundred likes and your content may resonate, it could be a good worth investment just to give a shout out. But those are typically what, what it looks like. I recommend it, I give it a shot. It's really cheap source of traffic and it can grow your account pretty quick. So. That's what I got for you guys today. If you guys like this, uh, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. I'm gonna create another video here in a second that's gonna go over another strategy that I used and uh, I'm excited. So for more details like this, just drop a follow or uh, subscribe and, and uh, more content will be created. Peace y'all.